What's up there, guys? So, as you all know, Elite 56 AJ Styles has been able to hit stores, and I was lucky enough to grab the Elite AJ Styles. But it did have some flaws with it, but I did fix it up, and I did make this figure a whole hell of a lot better. So, this is the Elite 57, no, Elite 56, sorry, I keep getting it messed up. AJ Styles, and the camera does look like it's purple, but that's because I got the flash on. So, I'll probably, some of you are probably thinking, what did I do to this? Well, first off, if you notice in small detail, I painted this black. Because this was originally blue. And the way that AJ's been wearing it now, it's black. So, I had to get in there with a toothpick, paint that. And it's black all around. It's black all the way at the belt, and it looks freaking awesome. And... One thing I did do, if you did get the AJ, you would notice that the P1 logo is a bit scratched. Like, for some reason, the, the like the P1 logo just has some white thing going to the side here. I don't know how to explain it. But, like, the, the logo was scratched, and it just did not look right. So I had to get in there with a toothpick, and then I covered everything up with it, and... Actually, it looks a whole lot better. And the one thing that I did do with it that Mattel did not do is I added knee pads. Which is mind-boggling because they gave us that network spotlight, AJ. That had knee pads, but these didn't, though. But for some reason, they, Mattel just wouldn't add knee pads. But they kind of made up for it with this new head scan. I might have pointed this out, but this just looks like a, a normal AJ Styles head scan with like a... Some sort of macho man hair piece. Like, you can't tell me here. This this head, this hair piece is like a macho man. And then they just, you know, gave us a new AJ Styles face scan. I'm actually not sure, but I praise this head scan. They still gave us the same crappy torso. But I'm still happy with it. And then they gave us the different elbow pad. I still want them to give us that Bret Hart elbow pad. But yeah. So, yeah, this is the Elite 56 AJ Styles fixed up. I'm very happy with this. And I just wanted to make this quick video. So, yeah. Um, I have I had this for a while, and I had it for like three days, and the legs have already gotten loose on this thing. So, if something breaks on here, I will be prepared to do some swaps, because I do have some customs in mind, especially with these hands. Because I think what Mattel did, I feel like Mattel just reused the Elite 47 AJ Styles arms, and then they, Mattel just decided, hey, why don't we just reuse these arms and put them on the elite 56 but i do i do like these arms these arms are pretty badass so yeah if this figure does break i will be putting it onto something um i i did do something with an aj styles that will be featured on a weekly custom soon i can't speculate when but then i also got a chris jericho and um ah no i'm not gonna get this aj that so i got a jericho i got a figure I got a Jericho, I got an AJ coming up, and believe it or not, I actually got another guy coming up, but I'm not going to reveal who it is, you'll have to watch that episode. So, yeah, this pretty much just wraps up the video, I just wanted to get this out of the way, this is taped, so for all we know that that video could have already been posted, so I'm very sorry with this, this is taped. So, yeah, thank you for watching this video. Please drop a like, comment, subscribe, to sweep that like button, and hopefully you'll be able to pick this up. Like me, I was able to get it at my local Target, which I lucked out on. I went back. I was going to pick it up for Cloud Kid 120. They didn't have it, so I'll get them something else. So thank you for watching this video. Please drop a like, comment, subscribe, to sweep that like button, and I'll see you guys in the next video. And I'm going to go take a massive crap.